Ooh, she, wow, she's windy and cold out here this morning. I had hoped to do more of a, a vlog as I'm out in the field, but unfortunately with really, really high winds, it's just not going to happen. But I did want to show you a Moda Hillman's Marsh. I'm wondering what the best, maybe not the best, but really, really good habitat for these birds. It was short. So I can see this pond area is all flooded. Tons of ducks and all that stuff out here. But what we're looking for, it's a bit hard to tell here, maybe with the video. When you have a flooded area like this, these exposed, exposed, um, these exposed muddy flats here, that is perfect, perfect habitat for these uh, shorebirds. Probably a couple hundred ducks out here that are starting to get their breeding plumage. Some yellow legs, but that's all we were able to capture. I was hoping to see the American Avocet, which had been reported out here, as well as a black belly plover and the golden plover. But uh, no luck. I'm not saying that they're not here, they're just not here at this particular moment. So I'm not going to spend any more time. Um, I've glassed the whole area and I haven't seen any signs of them. So we're going to slowly work our way out of here. We'll probably have some photo opportunities on the way over to, uh, over to Peely. And then, uh, yeah, we're going to go over to Point Peely and uh, do a few trails there. Hit the point and uh, the Marsh Boardwalk. Maybe hit uh, West Beach. We'll see. Um, there's a few things out there that I'm, have been reported that I'm hoping they're still there and I'm going to have an opportunity to get. So let's get out of this wind and hop in the truck, warm up, have a coffee, and head on over to the point. Well, we made it back to the truck. I got stuff falling all over the place here. Let me just reorganize myself here. All right. Oh, wow. It is, it's actually only seven. It's actually only 7.35, but, oh, my knees are killing me. Uh, it's quite cool. It's only six degrees, but or we have winds gusting up to 45 kilometers an hour, so. That makes it pretty bitter being out in those open areas in the water like that. So I don't know if you were able to hear when I was talking out there because of the wind, but um, we spent about an hour, 45 minutes or so out here. There were reports of American Avocet out here, black belly plover, American plover, but I wasn't able to uh, get any shots of those. We did have a flock of about 200 Dunlin flying around and landing and I got some shots and video of that and a couple uh, greater yellow legs uh, there's quite a few in here they were kind of further back and I didn't want to risk getting up and walking back further um, and spooking them all 
at first I was a little upset because I got out to the edge and just like an idiot I never checked my camera um, I was more concerned about getting everything ready and getting out to the spot and as I was standing over the area kind of trying to determine where I was going to set up and trying to see what was in the area I saw something I didn't know if it was a great blue heron or sandhill crane so when I went to put the camera on it to get it in focus and get a better view I realized I didn't put my SD card on my camera so I had to come all the way back to the truck get my SD card and head back to my spot which put me out about 15 minutes however it actually turned out okay because I didn't realize that I left one of my dome lights on in the truck, so I don't feel so bad. So we're skipping off. Oh, I gotta get my thing set up here. So we're gonna skip out of here now. It's really good timing. We're gonna head take about a take the I don't know five ten minute drive over to Point Peely. Spend some time in there. I'm gonna head out to the point, check there. I'm gonna walk the boardwalk trail and maybe one other trail. I'm not too sure yet. We'll kind of see how things are looking see if uh, there's much activity out there and then uh, plan our day based on what we're seeing and hopefully we'll be able to get one of those lifers but um, I don't know I'm not overly confident right now based on this wind but don't know until you go out there so bear with me we're gonna work our way over there and then we'll see how uh, Point Peely's looking <laughs> 